Hello and welcome to PCI Tech TV. In today's Tech TV episode, we will provide you an overview of PCI's new, fast, and accurate high quality ortho mosaic capability that uses an innovative 2.5D hybrid digital surface model editing technique that allows instant ortho preview on the fly. Let's start by opening the DSM so we can make edits and improve the end quality of our orthos. Here's the DSM of 18 images over Quebec City. And these 18 images have 60% forward overlap and 30% side overlap. One of the key trouble spots in this type of data set, this type of high resolution data set, is uh, bridges and overpasses. Here we have an overpass that's crossing over a major highway. And uh, you can see that we have some issues. There's some squiggly lines along the road and uh, we also have some pretty major distortions along the bridge. Let me let me load that up at one-to-one -one resolution. You'll, you'll see what I mean. So this really isn't an acceptable product. We have, as I mentioned, some squiggly lines and the edge of the bridge is quite distorted. So what we'll do is we'll use our 2.5D editing tools to clean this up really quickly. I'll switch back to the DSM and the first thing I'll do is I'll create a polygon for the underlying road. So what I want to do is I want to flatten all of this elevation here where I'm having these problems and then I want to build it back up. So I'm going to digitize along the highway So you can see that really quickly I'm able to create a polygon here that I'm going to use. And I'll switch back to the DSM. And what I want to do is fill this polygon using the opposite ends. So there we have it. So that filled up the polygon with the uh, elevation values from the opposite ends and created a gradient. So if we reload our area, we'll see what that did. So you can see that the road where there was some distortion along the edge of the bridge, that's cleaned up. The bridge is nice and straight now, the overpass. However, we have this really bad shift and, and this still really isn't an acceptable product. So, so the next part is we need to actually fix the, uh, the top part of the uh, overpass. So we'll do that simply by creating another polygon. And we do want to be accurate in collecting our polygon. So we'll switch to the ortho mosaic preview. And we'll click, we'll enter a polygon along the edge of the uh, overpass. So this, this can be done really quickly, as I mentioned. And I'm actually going to extend this polygon down to the end of this intersection where we have these wavy lines. This is probably due to some vehicles that were uh, at the stoplight or waiting for the uh, light to turn and in between the different uh, images that were taken. So now we have our polygon, let's switch back to the DSM and we'll do an opposite ends fill again and we'll apply that. Now we actually need to overwrite the bottom polygon with these values. So we'll apply the with, uh, with an overwrite and let's load up our uh, one to one ortho preview and take a look and see what that did. So that's pretty good, that's much better. So we have our nice uh, road underneath which is straight, our bridge is lined up and uh, I'm actually going to load a larger area so you can see uh, what what changed overall in this in this location. Okay, so I've got the overpass loaded at one to one now that we've created our two polygons to fix the elevation. And you can see that we have a much nicer looking image now. So if I pan through this uh, data set, uh, you see that our bridge edge is nice and straight. Uh, the uh, underlying road looks good and all of these squiggly lines that were there before are now gone. 